Anyone is welcome to donate dresses they may have laying around, including staff. Just bring them in tomorrow to the front office or to the AMR in the afternoon. I'll send it back to the desk for the rest of your newscast. So why are the Great Lakes water levels so high? The first step to answering this question is by looking at climate, weather, and the natural cycle of the lakes. The lakes have a cycle where the level of the water rises and falls almost every 20 years. But what does this mean for water levels? Jeff Lutz, a general forecaster at the U.S. National Weather Service in Gaylord, Michigan, explains how the weather, in fact, does affect the Great Lakes. Earth's atmosphere is 1.78 degrees warmer than its long-term average, meaning everything else on Earth also warms, including our water. Ultimately, changes in climate will affect weather patterns. Climate change can influence severe weather by causing longer droughts and higher temperatures. With the weather warming due to climate change, it heats up water, which can cause bigger rain, snow, or even thunderstorms, which in turn could increase water levels. It is hard to see the changes on a day-to-day -day basis like a weather pattern, but in the long run, climate change will have an effect on weather and the Great Lakes.